In this problem, we have a block resting on an inclined plane. We want to find the vertical and horizontal components of the block that are parallel and perpendicular to the plane. This problem is a little different because we are tilting our axis 37 degrees. The first thing we want to do is draw out what the components look like and see how they act in regards to the plane. Since our axis is tilted, we will draw a coordinate grid at the tail of our vector. Notice that our weight is actually in the third quadrant. That will make our x component and our y component negative. Here are the components in blue. We still form a right triangle with the x component adjacent to the angle we will use. We must find the angle to solve for the components. This is the angle we will use for our vector triangle. A right triangle has been drawn in yellow. We will use this to find the angle we need. Since all of the angles of a triangle add up to 180 degrees, we can subtract 37 from 90 to get the angle in the top corner. The angle is 53 degrees. Now we can draw our vector triangle. The components have been labeled and can be easily solved for. We will solve for our x component first. Input our values and find wx to equal negative 30 newtons. Next we will find wy. Input our values and find wy to equal negative 40 newtons. We will use this skill of finding components parallel and perpendicular to plane quite often in later chapters.